And I found a hole. I found a hole. There's also. I found other holes. You got a nice hole. Uh, look, there's water lots. Water. And lots of water. I am under the water. This is intro, I guess, to a video at some point. I'm not gonna ride my bike today, but I will in this video. So yeah, watch crack and not mine. Get my booty hole and then run you. What he said. You're probably gonna wanna sniff my bumbus. This looks very safe. I'm scared of walking on that. I don't blame you because I am too. It's moving. Oh yeah. Oh gosh. Go oh gosh. Oh, it's cracking. We're doing danger. We're doing stunts here, but we're doing stunts for the boys. Look, agua. There's agua there, and a lot more there. Hello, Canada. Come at me. This is America. We don't we don't deal with this Canadian. I'm gonna go all the way out there. There's more stuff that way. They're they're all the way down there. All the way. Do crack. Parkour. Update before we ride bikes, we found an old structure. And more water. Uh, my phone's almost dead, so I'm gonna turn you off till we're inside of it. We definitely should come back to this location and ride bikes. This is cool. Here, just grab my hand, little baby. Grab my hand. Reach. Coral reef. There might be homeless people that live here. Hello? I'll leave you alone if you scream at me. Okay. We got a peek in. Anybody in there? Doesn't look like it. This is not very cool. Look at that. We almost tried to cross through that stuff. It doesn't matter, there's no way to get up here. Yeah, we would have had to have gone the same way we went. Look at the giant tire. Huh? Oh, Jesus, like this is dope. What a little birdie. There's a diesel can. This building is dope though. It's very cool. Let's see if we can there's go a little in. window in it. Yeah, we gotta go try to go in it now. Okay, so there's the door. It's locked. Can't go in that way. But Hey Luke. Anybody in here? There's nobody. Oh gosh. I barely fit. Come on, little boy. That's weird looking cool. It's very dark in here, but there's a window. This is all you need. You got your cores. You got your window. Oh, gosh. That goes to the basement, Beanie. We gotta be quiet. If anybody's down there. <laughs> okay, just hang on a minute before you start following me. Seriously, stay up there. Because if this breaks and I get stuck, there's no way for me to get out. I don't think it's going to. Uh, yeah, you, you you stay there, and then if it's safe, I'll let you come down. This is like a submarine room, bro. I doubt it. You can't see much because I don't have a good light, because I'm stupid. But let me go all the way to the water. This is so creepy. Look, somebody comes back here and drinks beer. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at how cool. That's water, that's under the water. This is so cool. Uh, I think so, if you want to come down, just be careful. Very cool. Don't know what this is supposed to be, but, but yeah, this is very interesting. Of There's stagnant water down there. There's done nothing else down there, but all right, let's keep it moving. Keep it moving. Oh gosh, that's so scary. 
Oh my gosh, this is so scary. It's not really, but it's so scary. Very interesting. Okay, well. Hey, the phone didn't die before we did that. Freaking cool as hell, man. Now we gotta go back home. That's more scary than me, too. I fit, I swear I fit. What? I would not touch it. Come on, little turd. We found this. My phone has had 1% charge for the last every clip you've seen, so I'm trying to consolidate my battery. So this is what this bike looks like now. I'm gonna put them tires on it, put my handlebars on it, a pedal, because it's only got one pedal. And uh, then we're gonna ride it, so yeah. Yeah, we put the pants to complete, back to complete, you know? Blackie. Blackie. What are you doing, Blackie? Blackie was formerly known as Obama, but now her name is Blackie. Yes, it's a her. Anyways, got them ugly white things off. I like that they're white, but they're way too small. Too thin. We like them. We like them thick. Oh yeah, and I got, I got to clean this thing. Look, look at how dirty it is. It's disgusting. So we're gonna clean it a little bit. One hour later. Oh yeah, I just scratched the heck out of my truck. She's uh, much better, much much cleaner. Still not great, but we'll take anything we can get with this bike at that point. Okay, boys, grand finale. You ready? My hands looking looking pretty good you know this took unbelievably long and there's my other bike that's I gotta borrow the handlebars from this because I they're the only ones that are the right height for me anyways I got some really bad old tires on here I think I already told you that custom seat that's destroyed that my sister made for me oops it was gonna get destroyed one way or another um the fork, that guy is bent, and it bent these uh, bolts. The whole front hub, wheel, and fork are like trash, but it's cassette. I do think the uh, spindle in here, uh, that the part in there is uh, bent. Either that or the sprocket's bent, but the sprocket looks pretty, pretty straight and I have it super duper tight like there's that's a serious tight spot because I could not get the wheel to go on straight and I'd about had it so I can fix that later I'm sure but uh, I'm gonna try to write it for a minute here with my my destroyed hand oh it's a lot heavier than my bike I also got boots on which is not a good idea it's Super heavy compared to my other bike. I think it's mainly the wheels and the frame. Holy crap, this thing is solid as shit. Oh my lord. Throw your back out trying to manually. I got boots on and plastic pedals. I'm totally gonna hurt myself. Let me go throw on some riding shoes real quick. I'm not gonna lie. I think it looks better than my normal bike. It's also cassette, so give me a break. I have, I ride Tony's cassette every once in a while, but outside of that, I don't touch cassette. Some normal shoes make this way better. Oh, I'm so not used to having weight on a bike. Oh gosh. It's crazy to me that I rode this at some point. My other bike is so much lighter. So far, she doesn't feel terrible. 
She's making noises. That's okay. Got to break them in. Oh god. I'm definitely not used to this bike. Holy crap! This way is like literally four times more than I'm used to. Let's see if we can get a fakie. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Whoa! That's hilarious. I can't ride cassette at all anymore. How do people ride cassette? There we go. Took me a minute. Oh. I got one peg on the front. That's it. All I got is one peg. That's all I need. Oh, these are so much easier on cassette. I do miss that about cassette. You can freaking tire tap the hell out of everything. Oh my gosh. Well, with minor adjustments, it's actually not half bad. I do need to do a bar spin though. Oh yeah, bump. Bar swing pretty good on it. Of course I say that and then that happens. Oh my hand. I'm not throwing any more bars. Oh my hand. They weren't pretty, but they were bar spins, okay? 